What's up guys, I'm Rustin from RustinBurtech.com and this is another tutorial in assembly programming. Now in this class I'm going to show you guys how to use the SBB instructions. So let's get started. Before we get started, now I know a lot of you guys have been having problems downloading and installing MU8086. So I uh, put up a new link to MU8086. It's a ROAR file, so you don't have to worry about how to extract it. It's just a regular ROAR file. And I'm going to leave the link in this description. If you guys have any questions and you have any concerns about installing MU8086, you can email me at support at rossmertech.com and I'll help you guys out. And again, that link is also going to be in the description. So let's get started. So what is the SBB instruction? The SBB instruction subtracts both the source operand and the value of the carry flag from the destination operand. So let's get started and I'll show you exactly what it does so let's maximize this here and uh, the first thing we're going to need to do we're going to move into a h the value of seven now we're going to uh, move into b h the value of one now we're going to subtract uh, from b h to all right and finally, we're going to use the SBB instruction, right? This is the SBB instruction here. And we're going to type in our uh, destination operand. Our destination operand is AH. And the source operand is going to have a value of 0. So again, uh, the, the way the SBB instruction works, it subtracts the value of the source operand and the carry flag, whatever the value of the carry flag, if it has a 1 or a 0. Uh, so both together subtract into the destination operand. So let's say uh, right now um, we have a value of 7 in AH, right? Well, we're using a move into BH and we're subtracting the value of 2 from BH so we can uh, trigger the carry flag, right? So if, whenever you subtract a bigger number into a smaller number, the carry flag is set. So we want the carry flag to be set. So when we use the SBB instruction, the carry flag will be set. So the carry flag should have a value of 1, right? And 1 and 0 is 1, so 1 subtract the destination operand, which has a value of 7. So 7 take away 1 is 6. So when this is done, uh, AH should have a value of 6. So let's test it out. I'm going to hit emulate here. All right, so right here, let's actually bring up our flags here too so you guys can see. I'm going to put the flags here. Now, our first line of code is highlighted. Move into AH7, so let's hit single step. Our second line of code here is highlighted move into BH value 1. As you can see here, once I hit single step, BH has a value of 1 and uh, AH has a value of 7. Now we're going to use the subtract instruction, right? We're going to subtract uh, 2 from uh, the value of BH, which has a value of 1. So that should trigger the carry flag. So let's hit single step here. And as you can see, the carry flag has been triggered and has a value of 1. Now, our final line of code is highlighted, the SBB instruction. So basically, the SBB instruction, what's going to happen is the SBB instruction is going to take the value of the carry flag, right? If the carry flag is set and has a value of 1, or if the carry flag has a value of 0, it's going to take that. Uh, basically, you're adding it with the source operand, right? So if the carry flag was set, right, and it had a value of 1, it would add to 0. So 0, 1 is 1, and 1 would subtract uh, into AH, right? So basically, AH has a value of 7, so 7 take away 1 would be 6. So the value of AH should have a value of 6. So let's test it out again and hit single step. As you can see over here, AH has a value of 6. I'm going to explain from the top. We moved into AH, the value of 7, right? So AH had a value of 7. We moved into BH, the value of 1. So we subtract uh, uh, BH, with, uh, which has a value of 1, with 2 to set the carrier flag. Remember, when you subtract a bigger uh, number into a smaller number, it, it triggers the carry flag. So now, since the carry flag is set, we're going to use the SBB instruction. Now, the SBB instruction subtracts uh, whatever value is in the carry flag together with uh, the source operand into the destination operand. So 7 take away 1 equals 6. Remember, uh, there was a 0 here, but our carry flag had a 1, so 7 take away 1 gave us a 6. And that's pretty much it. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys like this video, please give me a like. If you want more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. I'm Rustin from RustinBurtech.com, and thanks for watching.